All right, here we have the last comparison of the uh, Azo CG211 display to another one. Here we're looking at the color gamut of the CG211 in LAB color space. And what we're going to do is compare this to a less expensive uh, Azo display, the CG19. So I'll go ahead and set this as the comparison here. Uh, and here's the gamut of the CG19. As always, where we're seeing this uh, solid color poke out of the diagram here, that means it's the uh, gamut of the CG19 poking through, meaning it has more gamut in that area. And wherever the white wireframe is showing, that's the color gamut of the CG211, indicating the 211 has more gamut. And we see much the same thing we saw here with other um, comparisons with other sRGB monitors, is that the uh, CG211 does have a good bit more uh, uh, color gamut in the blues and purples, um, fading back in the reds, uh, slightly less in the reds, and a little bit more up in this uh, green yellow cyan plane. Uh, everywhere else, the uh, CG19 is actually a little bit, <coughs> has a little bit more gamut than the CG211, but the differences are very, very slight. Uh, you can't really see it too well here, but there's just a very slight, just a hair more uh, on the um, CG19. So overall, the CG211 uh, does give us a bit better uh, look at uh, some of the, the blues and purples, but uh, in other respects, the two displays are quite, color, uh, quite similar color-wise.